Well, another big win for Wheaton College football tonight here in Eau Claire, Wisconsin. A uh, very difficult task. You have to drive up here as we do on a lot of our away trips, and then you got to sit all day long in a hotel and sort of twiddle your thumbs and just wait for this to happen. And, and our kids handled that and did it well against a good football team. Uh, and they may not have the record that we expect them to have, but this is a team that's got 10,000 kids going to school here with great facilities and a lot of things Wheaton College doesn't have. And our kids came out and played exceedingly well and really beat a good football team here tonight. Uh, tough thing was we lost some players, man. We lost some players, and uh, we lost some players during the week, and we lost more players during this game. And I think one of the biggest testaments to Wheaton football, though, is the guys that came in, stepped in, really did an exceedingly good job. We got some depth, but we are going to use that off week, and hopefully we can get some of our kids well and back together again because it was a rough night from an injury perspective. But those that stepped up and came in really played well. Hats off to them. You know, I know our kids are looking at the scoreboard over there and they're going 56 to 17, coach. You got to ease up on us, but. I said before, our bar, the bar is Salem. The bar is to win this thing. And uh, when that's the bar, 56 to 17 at Eau Claire is not good enough. It's just not. And there are things we got to get better. And if we want to go to Salem someday, then we need to uh, play better than we did tonight. And our kids know that. They know that it's not that I'm not happy with them. But as long as we all are on the same page, that that's our goal, then this isn't good enough. And we need to get better. But congratulations to them, and we're 3-0.